Alright guys, this is uh, Mr. Mechanic 0313 and um, we're going to do a little bit of a, uh, a snow removal test. We're going to do it on the same property twice, two different times. Once with the class, it's a modded tractor, it's not part of the, uh, the one DLC. We're going to use the class with the salt spreader that came out with Seasons and the plow and then we're going to use the TLX 2020 that just came out with the snow removal has the plow has a salt thrower and a snow melter piece on the back right along with that dump bed so um, we're probably going to go with the class first and we're going to see which one does better now yes I have plowed this parking lot before so it's going to be a little easy than what it would be with snowy lands so let's get into it um so yeah we're going to use the class now well, let's open up the help window so we can see what's going on here and we're going to do this nice and simple pass. We're going to go where we already have been. Actually, we're going to start right about here. I think our goal will be to see if we can get all the way up to the word class up there. As quickly and as efficient as possible. So be using the salt spreader but first we're gonna go with the um with the plow so we're gonna lower it and we're gonna go right, i'm not gonna count that so far it looks like seven mile an hour seems to be a good uh, Okay. So about uh, four to seven mile an hour to do that. And you know what? We're just gonna go right, right past it again, right next to it, with the salt spreader and the plow. Okay. If I can get the thing on stop. There we go. Now we're going to put a salt spreader on. We're going to floor it. Not too bad. Not too bad. And you know what? No, we're we're going to do uh, a pass on the other side of the salt spreader here. I wasn't paying attention to how many miles an hour that was. Now we're going to jump in the TLX. We're going to take off the ice melter. Because that is so cheating with the ice melter. We're just going to drop that right there. Oh, look at that. It's already starting to plow it. And then I think we're going to go to the farmyard and test it in the farmyard itself here on Sandy Bay. Now I have a full thing of salt, in, well, almost a full thing of salt. And we're going to again try this without the spreader. And we're just going to lower, oh wait, might be nice if I select it. Lower it and push it off to one side. Now it's aimed a little bit better. So. Alright, you ready? We'll see how fast we can do this. Oh, 
I saw 15 miles an hour. Alright, now we're going to try with the self spreader. I again did not pay attention to how fast, but these two compared to this one here, this little one, this is wider than that plow too, um, is going to be quite a, uh, I, I say it's quite a, in, you know, better job couldn't figure out the word I was looking for alright I am going to show you uh, these in in the store so I'm just going to switch off of that and switch to this so I can show you how much cheating this is I'm not even going to use the plow matter of fact I will go backwards See? It removes everything. Like here, I'll go to that big pile. Everything is just gone. I don't know how. I think it's pretty neat. gonna fill this up real quick. We're gonna fill them all, uh, everything up and I will meet you over at the farmyard. I just bought a bunch of pallets of seed uh, of road salt. So um I'm going to I'm gonna take this one over first and then I'm gonna grab the other one and bring that over. I don't know if you know Sandy Bay or not. Um, I am on PS4. So. Um, and the two, the two vehicles I am testing out are very close in mile per hour. I think the truck has 450 and the class has 445 horsepower. Not mile per hour, sorry, horsepower. Being that the this is a highway truck, it, well, it could be a highway truck. It can do 75 mile an hour, which I wouldn't recommend it because then it kind of gets a little laggy. So I have traffic turned off, so I don't have to worry about traffic. Because sometimes traffic can get really annoying. Like blocking, you know, blocking you and you hear them go me, honking their horn. Yeah, it's really annoying. Well, it can be. And besides, I'm going to be using this roadway right here to store this. And actually, I'm going to drop the plow off. Just there. And, uh, this. You can only use that plow with this truck. You can't use any other plow because it's actual plow attachment. Oh, hey. It's a snowman. I didn't know that was there. That's pretty neat. I haven't explored this map all that much with uh, Snowy on. I mainly just use this saved game for... Uh, for testing purposes, mainly testing snow equipment, because uh, we've had quite a bit of it. 
like we had the uh, thin track snow removal gear blowers uh, snow throwers we, we had a bunch of stuff like that so and yes I am using the chain tires but tires don't make any difference in traction that I'm aware of it it just looks apart so Uh, and this is pretty neat. The sign over there says icy conditions, please drive with care. I think that's awesome. That's a neat little detail that they added. So, this is first person. Mirrors, semi work, um, got blinkers, your lights. You don't have um, a beacon light. Letting you know the beacons are on. I do have a beacon here. There we go. And you cannot put any crops or anything in this that I am aware of. That blue one is the salt spreader. I need to test something real quick because I had this one glitch out on me. I was testing it before I closed the game down because I had to go do stuff. Um, so. Okay, yeah, this one glitched out on me. I find out it, if like it glitches out, um, you can uh, just sell it and buy a new one. Because they're not all that expensive, I will show you. You can find everything for this truck under ma uh, miscellaneous. You got the trail boss uh, bed, you got the flat bed, you got the tippet, uh, you got the tippet trailer, you got the open bed, which is what you need for the salt spreader. It's just like the tippet bed, but it just don't have a back. You got the liquid, you got the logging, and this is the other stuff here. Um, the here is the two uh, in, uh, stuff that came out with the seasons mod. You got the salt spreader and the um, plow. Salt spreader is twelve thousand. We'll use two slots, and that will use three if you are on console. If you're not on console, don't worry. I have some other snow removal stuff, but I don't like it, right along with the NMC stuff. NMC is a good, but these are only seven grand each. Seven grand each. Doesn't matter if you're using the salt spreader or the snow melter. So, so if like one of these glitch out on you, you know, you can just sell it and get a new one. And they are nine slots. Oh, and I, I have two of these. Um, I'm going to sell this one. Hoping I sold the right one. No, I did not. Alright, I'm going to sell them both. So you can see how many slots I don't I didn't write anything down I probably should have but I didn't so yeah nine slots and okay they're both nine slots and then the snow plow is only 200 uh, and you know there's different things you can do everything is customizable you can do design color, main color, I don't know, we'll go with green, I don't know. Ooh, that actually looks kind of nice, I like that. So, um, I'm going to need one of these again. I'm just going to keep it basic, I think. Yeah, I'm just going to keep it basic. So, I'm not going to have you sit through getting that one again. 
bringing that over to the yard. So I'm probably going to cut that out then. Uh, I do, however, need to move that before it really messes me up. There we go. Might as well fill it on here. Yeah, I just wanted to make sure that was the right one. Hopefully I don't need to buy no more salt. So yeah, I'm going to drop this one here. I'm probably actually going to cut everything out from here. Like, I don't know what. From, uh, after I'm done filling this up. So, so yeah, when this one's filled up, you ain't going to see any of the rest of this video. You ain't going to see this part because I'm just going to cut it all out. So, I will see you in, a, well for you it would be a second, for me it would be like 20 minutes. No, maybe not 20 minutes, 10 minutes. So, see you there. Okay, um, I brought you back for one reason. I am curious on something before I put the other spreader in this. If you can actually put snow in the back of this truck. So, I just got a wheel loader. So, yeah, I didn't bring the case over. I got the wheel loader. I modded the case, wheel loader. So, I know, curiosity kills the cat, but guess what? Satisfaction brings it back. This is a nice looking uh, wheel loader, so. I don't know if this will work, but it's worth a shot. Right? I should have went with orange. Alright, nice. 6,000 meters. I am not the best with this thing. So, bear with me. No, it does not look like you can. Nope. Okay. Good to know, though. So, yeah, you can't put anything in that bed. Alright. So. I'm going... I'm probably going to cut back out. Alright. Um, so yeah, I'm here, got everything here, got the case, got the TLX, so, um, there's the melt bit, that's the salt thrower, and I'm just gonna do one thing, I'm going to save right now. So that way I can just load back in and clap. So we're going to start off with the case. But first we might want to open the gate. And I'm not the best person when it comes to plowing. So I'm just going to start here. Maybe turn the blade. No, no, I think we're going to we're gonna get a, like a head on start. There you go. Close enough. We're going to go straight. We're going to throw the rock salt thrower on. And I do have the blade lowered. And it seems like this plow is having quite a hard time. With this I'm probably only going to do one pass. 
like one complete way around everything. If I can even get that far. And then we're going to compare it to everything else. Just going to push that into the workshop. I have a funny feeling that the TLX might win this. Like we're going to be able to drive completely, well we should be able to drive completely around without um, having to, well we're going to do a complete lap, we're going to, you'll see. Yeah, maybe I'm not doing it the best way, but, you know, it's probably how I would try to do a beginning lap, a uh, beginning way around. Oh, where did all that snow go? And don't worry, that's just how everything is. Turn on some nights. There normally isn't. Oh no, there is a road over this way. I'm only able to go five miles an hour right now. And these both have roughly the same amount of horsepower. So, we'll see when it comes time to the TLX. And then I will probably go into the landscaping pool to see, to compare them. So, uh, yeah, over there by that garage is where we want to try to get to. I don't know if we're even going to make it that far. Let's try pushing the snow that way. I know I'm not following the road that's normally here. I am slipping like heck. Oh, I know, I do like those animations of the snow being pushed up and around the plow. I think it, I think it's awesome looking. Alright, there's the chickens. That's the sheep. You could do chickens and sheep. Oh, I'm out of rock salt already. I wasn't able to get all the way around. And we're going to connect back up with right there by the gate. Okay. <coughs> We're gonna go landscaping tool. Oops. Pardon me. We need to go to the farm. Okay. So far is what it looks like. It don't look good. <laughs> Honestly, I don't think I don't know. you'd be slipping and sliding the whole way. So, all right. Now this is where I'm probably going to cut out, and I will see you in just a minute. All right, welcome back. Um. So yeah, we're gonna just hit continue. As you can see, we're not plowed over. Oh, that's funny. That saved the last spot where I was. Okay. So, as you can see, there's no plowing at all. Not a single snow piece moved. So, we're going to jump in this. And now we can start the test. Alright, this one we're going to start here. We're going to open this up. 
and we're going to do the same thing. Best possible uh, position for the blade, and we're going to start. And you can see that this is salt it, not spread it, or melt it. Wow, am I, what the heck am I doing wrong? There we go. I still think that this plow is better, even though know, it might not be looking it. I think the salt thrower is way better too. But it might just be in my head. I'll tell you one thing, I've stopped so many times with, uh, with this, with it still running salt, and I just ran out. Oops. Alright, let's check the flyover. Already, to me, it looks way better. There's, yeah, there's quite a few spots missed, but it's wider. And I just did a, a really shitty job. Honestly. If you actually had the time to go there and plow everything properly, straight line, the full yard, you can get this looking really good. So. I'm going to cut it off here. Um, let me know which per, which one you prefer. The TLX setup or the standard in-game plow. Um, I am going 
to uh, have to edit this video quite a bit, so uh, leave in the comments which one you like better, and uh, don't forget to like and subscribe. And this was Mr. Mechanic 0313, signing off.